Hello and welcome to this video tutorial series Crypto 101 how to buy hash power with Bitcoin. So what you want to do is you go into your back office, you're going to go under the section of my crypto and uh, you're going to go, uh, you see your dash bar, dashboard, you're going to go to increase hash rate here on the right hand side. Um, then what you want to do is you want to select your contract. So you see on the left hand side Bitcoin, Dash, Litecoin, Ethereum and Zcash. So you're going to go to start now um, and uh, there you see you need to select it um, and we do have right now Bitcoin, Zcash, Dash, Litecoin and Ethereum um, available for mining. So let's go here further, go next um, and there you're going to select how much do you want to mine, how much of a, a contract do you want to actually mine? And you see this little slider here, which you can move around. And as you move it around and you move it further, it's going to increase in your hash route and therefore increase your estimated daily payout. Um, we do have a discount rate at the end uh, where you see it here. So you need to actually uh, track that hand till the end. So you come up to the discount rate of $1,950 um, for 15 Terra hash. So now what you want to do is we go further and we want to select in the payment option um, Bitcoin because we want to pay with Bitcoin for that. And we're going to go next, we're going to go confirm. So you need to tick the box first that you, of course, understand. There's a 1.7 transaction fee which will be applied to all purchases with Bitcoin. And we're going to go to confirm. So uh, when we confirm, you will see that window coming up here, which says waiting for payment. And you see here, um, that is actually the time. If you uh, take longer than this, you will be actually timed out. So this is going to, of course, it's a, it's a, it's a clock, which it's going to go count down. And you see here the order and you see the reference number. And you see that you got to send a 0 0.01299. This is a $30 contract which we selected um, in order to purchase that Bitcoin mining. And with the fees, it's going to cost $30.51. So you've got to send this to this Bitcoin address here. So what you want to do is you want to now copy that Bitcoin address here because this is what you're going to put into uh, the account where you are sending it from. So you're going to go into your Bitcoin wallet where you're going to send uh, the Bitcoin to Swiss Gold Global and you need to copy that address because this address is where you're going to send it and you do the same with the amount of Bitcoin. You also want to copy just this amount of Bitcoin and um, in, uh, in, in the address where you're going to send it. So here in this example we use blockchain for uh, transfer blockchain.info so you see this particular account here um, has around uh, 1.68 uh, Bitcoin in there and as you see here we select send from this Bitcoin wallet um, to and we copied and pasted that address we saw before and we did copy the Bitcoin amount which would be in Euro $27.37 and it just shows in Euro because this particular account is actually in Europe where we deal with Euro. And you put in for the description business and uh, this is what you put in for the description business and then you just very simple go next step. So your next step you will see from the Bitcoin wallet, it has been deducted um, this amount with uh, then the fees. And uh, in the blockchain.info, and this varies depending from which wallet you're going to send that. So we have people using Coinbase, we have people using Xapo, we have people using from Trezor. Whatever that wallet is which you are using, the fees will vary. So in this particular account here, we have sent it from blockchain.info and the blockchain is .info account is charging a transaction fee uh, of 1.27 euros. This is because again, this is in euros because it is a euro account. Um, and if you accept those fees, um, you're going to go send if you do accept those fees. Sometimes they are higher. Sometimes um, there's a lot of vari variations on that. Sometimes you want to may check out a different wallet. But uh, in this case, we just push conf uh, send um, and then you will see um, here your transaction 
is being confirmed. So the money has been taken out, but here you see it is still pending. It doesn't mean when your money has been taken out that it is uh, already arrived at Swiss Gold Global. It doesn't mean that. It just means it's out. Uh, it is at the it's, it's out in the cloud, so to say, and it is arriving at the exchange, but it's not yet in Swiss Gold Global. So, but but it's it's um, left your account, um, and the transaction here is being confirmed. So let's go to the next um, page here, and there you see um, received. So now you see actually the order, such and such, $30.51 um, is received. And it says here, payment has been received, but needs one Bitcoin confirmation to be accepted. Please return to the merchant and allow up to 30 minutes for Bitcoin Network to confirm your payment. So this can take some time so long. Um, sometimes it's not going to get accepted, or sometimes it has left our account, um, and it is out in the cloud, um, but it is underpaid, or um, it was timed out. All those things can happen, and it can be 70 up to 72 hours actually gone, but it never really arrives at Swiss Gold Global. But in this case here, um, actually then comes the next window, because I did wait for, uh, for this purpose of this video, so I did wait a little bit, and it said received. Payment has been received, um, and um, that means now, well, um, it is received. Um, and I'm going to show you in the next um, uh, picture, which I have done here, um, that this payment um, is actually received and paid for. So all those steps you will see, and sometimes you're sitting there 10, 15, 20, 30 minutes um, until it is there, but you can do anything else on your computer, just have it there and, and wait for it, and eventually it will come through. Sometimes you have to do it again because it is not accepted. Um, that also can happen. But in this case, it did. So it's paid for. You see the order such and such has been paid. It's, that's why you see that here. Um, and uh, you got a thank you for your order. So when we go now back into the blockchain, um, so we go back into the uh, uh, blockchain.info address, as you see here. Um, I just uh, put it for you here you, that you see we have here already two confirmations. So it has been more than one confirmation, two confirmations, um, and um, it is, has gone out. Another way to check is as well as in your back office, you can then go to Purchase and Bonus History into in the section of My Crypto. Um, and uh, in this case, we saw here, uh, well, it has arrived, my Bitcoin um, payment, um, and uh, you see here the time it was received, um, and this was really shortly after it had been accepted by both sides. So it has gone out from my account, and it has gone um, to the exchange, and from the exchange it has gone to Swiss Gold Global, so automatically then it was purchased. If this is not happening, Okay, if this is not happening, if you don't see that here, um, well, it can be that it's either not yet received on the side of Swiss Gold Global, it could be it is underpaid, it could be it's timed out. And if this happens, um, what's actually happened um, if it's timed out or underpaid, um, well, eventually, um, so Swiss Gold Global will send you an email about that, and of course, then you need to provide your wallet, your public key, so they send you the money back. So those things, uh, they are not often, but it could happen. There's a lot of things um, which, of course, in this Bitcoin payment could happen. Sometimes there's just too many uh, transactions, and, and it's waiting in a long waiting line um, uh, to be processed. But in this, in this case, um, when I did shoot this video, it was very, very simple. And then you get automatically an email as well from Swiss Gold Global. And if you haven't got it, maybe check your spam or whitelist Swiss Gold Global. Um, and you see, dear Swiss Gold Global manga member, congratulations and thank you for your order. It is currently being processed through the Bitcoin blockchain protocol. And you see, upon your transaction being confirmed on the Bitcoin blockchain, your order will be completed. And again, note that orders paid with Bitcoin are not instantly processed like a credit card and can generally take from less an hour to 72 hours for the transaction to be accepted by the Bitcoin blockchain. 
and you can actually check the status when you go to blockchain.info by entering the transaction code, the transaction hash code. Okay? And um, if you're still not clear, if you still have questions, if you still have doubt, well, you can go into your back office under the help section and send a ticket to contact at swissgoldglobal.com. Thank you for listening to this tutorial and I hope to see you on further tutorials.